We have about six inches of new snow right here. We found up to 12 inches of new snow that fell last night in other areas around here. So uh, in the northern Madison range here in areas that got new snow last night, we're starting out with some dry snow instabilities. This isn't uh, showing any signs of instability on non-wind loaded slopes, but where it is wind loaded, we could definitely trigger avalanches. There's fresh slabs up near ridge lines and below big cornices. Um, and then the next problem we're gonna be dealing with, it's spring, things are changing quickly with the higher sun, longer, warmer days. And on sunny aspects, and as the temperatures warm above freezing, this new snow is gonna get wet and we'll start to get wet, loose avalanches uh, below cliffs and, and on sunny slopes. So be paying attention to, to changes in the snow surface throughout the day. If it starts to get wet and sticky, or you see roller balls, that's a sign that instability is increasing and uh, you wanna stay out of steeper terrain.